God damn, this shot fast as fuck too. Gotta figure out some way, somehow to slow them down. Do they blitz a little bit more? Do they play more zone Look. coverage? Right now, they don't know where to go because they're hitting them in every direction. RP girl. <laughs> you ain't got to worry about me. The Dallas offense here set to begin the drive. And that last drive. Three between the lines, so baby. The passing game resulting in the touchdown. He locked in right now. He's getting his fucking ass. The trenches. There was good protection there. Excellent protection. So now defensively. This is what I would have did to you, Sykes. Be the cool. Get lower than those guys. Fuck, oh, man. No. Find a way to run through them. You said what? Looking for gigs and it's intercepted. I mean, why not? Why not say it's a three, man? Two yards away from midfield at the 48 yard line. He had a little bit of the turnover bug last week. Three interceptions. Not an absolute disaster, but another one here. Do you start to get a little worried? You worry about your team as a whole because you have to find a way to make those interceptions cool. Why are you cutting, bro? They've got to go out there on sudden change at least hold people to field goals. If that keeps happening, they lose confidence in the quarterback, and then no one plays well. Hey, you know my line, though, P. If T-Mac hit, it's going to be a long game. They can hit big, or they can be dunks. Yeah, you're exactly right about that, because if they're forced to try and go around defenders behind the line of scrimmage, you can give yardage in order to gain it. But in this case, they gave yardage and didn't get it back. Now left side, a completion to his tight end. And they'll get him down as he's inside the 40. Give him 14 on that one and a first down. Nice job oh, there of utilizing his big target. He didn't overthink it. Understands the catch radius. Understands Man, we, that he knows how to use We got enough to run. Keep away from the ball and puts it right out there for the nice pickup. Throwing on first down, but this one winds up to be incomplete. I think he's got to be careful not to force anything into coverage oh, right shit, there. Jimmy. There weren't really any throwing lanes, but the best part for him, he's got second and third down to fall back on. That's me. I miss you on that one. Come on, bro. Don't that. Let me put this body to rest. Chicago. With his second touchdown here in this first half. And the Bears will extend their lead. Yo, my bra is nice fucking bitch. First half here, partner. And it's a first half that leaves us anticipating what can still come. I mean, two touchdowns already here through the second quarter. They got Curry up here dunking on this game. LeBron right. do all layups. And this will be a touchback as that sails over the end line. 25 yard line. About set for this next drive by the Cowboys offense. Come on, Blake. They're down Look at this shit. Don't get it. Point, needing to put something together as they have it first and ten. Steps away to his left. This free throw is fucking receiver complete. And they will get him down, but not before he gets very good yardage there. As that will lead us right into the two-minute warning. It'll go as a gain of 25 on a play that started back at 25. And we'll remind you that coming up at halftime, we'll join Jonathan Coachman and the gang in Orlando. Coach will have stats and scores from the early games going on here around the NFL. Now a toss left side into the hands of his tight end. I don't know his jump shot yet. Inside the 40, not quite to the 35. 13 yards as they've got the connection working. His second catch in a row. And he'll go down. The Bears get there for the sack. Hillel Nichols able to run him down for a loss of 12 that time. That huge loss on the sack makes this job much more difficult. Out of here, Terry. Down and 22 yards to go. Oh my God. He rifles one that's intercepted. Picked off near the 26. And the return here is stopped at the 35 yard line. When a team's turned it over three times in the first half, we just look at the offense and say, guys, what are you doing? But instead, we really should be looking at the defense. They've created the takeaways. Two interceptions, one cause fumble. They played awfully well, swarming to the ball here in the first half. 
to Montgomery to begin the drive. And unable to get downhill there as he'll take this up to about the 37. That was OC. Two yards on the carry there. It'll be second down. Certainly a nice Yo. job there by the defense rallying to the football and getting him on the ground. But I yeah, I know. Play gets made. I didn't know if it was through. Yes, it is. I didn't know if it was through the app so you could do it like that. I didn't know it was a state-by-state deal. Yeah, so they like, they make up little fucking game rooms here in the area I work at. And they be in there fucking gambling and shit. They really illegal. A lot of meth heads and shit be in there. A lot of dope that run around. Oh, that's a challenge. They hold the so we reach halftime with a visiting bear. Get his ass to guess what the score is. We send John over to Orlando for Jonathan Coachman and our EA 77 to 27. Take it away, coach. He hopped up. get the football first, and they trail here as well as we resume action in the third quarter. That'll be taken about a yard deep. Oh, if he could do it. Oh, good looking return set up here. Running room at the 50. Look oh, out. He's past oh, the 30. He will score. That's a score you felt they had to have here in the third quarter to get back in this game. And you know that there was an emphasis on their side. Hey, we know this. We know where we are. But sometimes that binds you up so much that you try too hard you don't get the score. A perfect combination of urgency, yet relaxed enough to get it done. The extra point splits the uprights, and that cuts the lead to 28-14. So now the other return teams out there as they'll try to duplicate what they just saw. And they will not get a chance to return this one as it's through the end zone for a touchback. Did you cash out the other day when you won? You're up. He's ass. He's ass. At the line, prepping for their next drive, the Bears offense. They'll come out throwing here to start the drive. He'll get that complete to his tight end commit. And he's taking Didn't he get a chance to make my off? Give him 30 yards there. I'm seeing a lot of guys shaking their heads on defense right now, particularly in the secondary. And when you see that going on, that is never a good sign. But it's understandable. They've been shredded so far. So the big play moves them all the way across midfield. It's first and 10 from the 45. A give to Montgomery out of the gun. Five yards is the tally on first down. That brings up second and five. That's a really good gain right there. They pick up five yards halfway to a first down. Uh -huh, I tried to pass that to Vince. Everyone's going to want to touch good the shit. football. There'll be a lot of chattering now because they've seen that they can move the line of scrimmage. Second and five. They'll set up the screen okay. to Montgomery. Yeah, up getting this one all the way down oh, inside like the 20. And I think that's a pretty good illustration of why they try to get the football into his hands out of the backfield. That was something else. First down, here's the run with Montgomery. And he is in. Touchdown, Chicago. David uh, Montgomery, up, his second touchdown on the season. And the Bears will add on to their lead. When you talk about a battle being won in the trenches, the oh, touchdown right there, a lot of credit on, to the bro. offensive line. Yeah, when you watch them surge across the front, they really created great space for the runner to get in. Now after the touchdown, here's Pinheiro to kick it off. That should have double block. Go to Jimmy. Oh, JK. And he'll be out of bounds here it's just past the 20-yard line. Let me try. Oh. 
The Dallas offense here set to begin the drive. And in enemy territory last time through the interception, we'll see what they do on this drive. Can't wait to see how it alters what they decide to do in play. He's got a man complete. And he gets this to the other side of midfield across the 45 before going out. An excellent gain, 35 yards. Obviously, they're not where they want to be right now on the scoreboard. Big plays like that, though, that'll trend them in the right direction. Yeah, a few more like that, they'll be right back in the game. And if they can continue to do that, maybe they'll inspire their defense as well. They'll get a few stops. So the big play gets them across midfield now for first and 10. I'm here. Oh my God. They go oh. play action with Hertz. Eluding the pressure right. Oh, he's got a man wide open, complete. He will make all the way that inside the 15 before they drop him. Boy, 30 more yards and another first down. Still all sorts of time left in this game, and you'd like to be able to say, take it one play at a time. But the truth is, they're probably going to have to hit on a few big plays in the passing game to close this gap, and that's a good start box. right there. Well, defensively, they haven't let him just sit in the pocket and get comfortable, and that's opposite a lot of game plans in today's NFL. Ordinarily, you're trying to keep the quarterback hemmed in. In this case, they brought the heat, and if he flushes out, they're fine with that. That's and they force another incompletion. Oh Escaping the pressure right. And he's going to keep it here. And he takes it inside the 10 to the 8 before he's out of bounds. He'll end up getting five out of that, but now they're looking at third down. Oh, we don't need no double. That's the shot stop. Jab stop. <laughs> yep. That's straight up. He'll look to throw. Now, I want to go cook on some steaks. They still keep that. He's taken down. Oh, trying to do a little too much. Getting outside of the pocket. And it results in a sack. Bilal Nichols picks up his second sack of the afternoon. And that is caught. Touchdown, Touchdown. Cowboys. Stephon I'm not playing you until you're ready, bro. His third touchdown now on the year. And the Cowboys I say I'm not playing you again until you're you ready. Bro. To 14. Mr. Bears, 31. Joey Sly now to kick after the touchdown. And this will not be returnable. It's out of the back of the end zone for a touchback. The Bears offense ready to go for their next drive. Their lead down to two scores after the touchdown a moment ago as they start with first and ten. This will be stopped about two yards shy of the marker. Eight-yard gain, second and two. First play of the drive. Let's give credit all around. Excellent blocking, but the guy carrying the ball, he was the finisher. A really nice run. I want to do that to you, P. You my own. Second and two. Open man is Komet, the tight end. Wow. And he goes yeah, out of bounds just shy of the 45. 11 yards there, first down. Jason, why you have to be He got a family, bro. I didn't even mean to do him. And he can pick up a lot of yardage after the catch. But in this situation, the defense was effective, able to stop him before he get a good head of steam going. Davion Taylor there. KD down. was going to have 30. Well, he barely had 34. You got to be able to improvise when the hole's not where you expect it to be. But in this case, there wasn't any improvisation that he could do. Who won it with Debo? Kind of like if you're trying to be a comedian on open mic night at the improv and you run into a tough crowd. And down he goes at the 49. That's what I like to hear. Just, just not a whole lot of room to operate there on that carry. <laughs> no, not at all. They did a really nice job staying in their proper places and not allowing any lanes to open up. That's what I like to hear. Balance. Out of the gun now on third down. Over the middle, and that's caught by Komet. Nah, a hey. T Mac ain't never hit like that. And 
this is obviously quite a performance. And most of the time when we talk about someone putting a team on their back, I think we're talking about a, a guy who runs the football. In this case, it's a guy out wide catching it, and he's done exactly that, truly leading his team right now towards victory. Three touchdown catches. He's been the headliner. That'll be taken about a yard deep. And that decision to bring it out ends up not being a good one. Cost him about five yards as he's tackled at the 20. Set for this next drive by the Cowboys offense. Good drive last time. Hey, it ain't so good. Passing the football. <laughs> Do you maybe mix it up now? Go to the ground game. Hey, Kirby Ronnie sent me a video of you walking around in high heels in Milwaukee, dog. Whoa. Just absolutely go in the opposite direction. So you got to make, you gotta make a 20 yard pass. Oh, you, you, want, you want me to send it back? Texas is the spot Let me know when you're ready. Hmm? Yeah, you want me to send it back? I know. I, mean, I really can't hear you right now. Bro, right? Yeah, I'm ready. This will I'm be a right loss of three, and now oh, you got the hint. Thought you wanted for it. What you going, Joey? Flush to his right. He may try and run for this. He'll crack. Hurts dangerous when he runs that. What you got going? He's got a first. We just saw a nice example of why teams often bring in awesome. baseball guys right, to good. teach quarterbacks how to slide in key wow. situations. You just search it, bro. Search together. Make sure he oh, we're still hurt. searching. He did exactly that yeah. on that play. A perfect slide to avoid the big yeah, hit. Yeah, we need to first down. This, that was Sykes talking. Yeah, that's what Sykes so. But uh, Ronnie sent, hey, Ronnie sent me a video of uh, you walking down the street from Milwaukee and from out here. This one goes for 19 yards. Back now in Arlington. A lot of folks starting to make their way to the parking lot. Their guys what y'all niggas is doing up there? Number four. First down, Hurts. This man got old ass Harris and Smith. Out right. <coughs> hey, I'm just telling you what he said. That not a surprise with the way that this one has gone. And he said he was running around a red pump. Just evident everywhere. This team? No, they, they was really black. Put the they was black. <coughs> they was black. And complete pass on first down. After that further investigation. After further investigation. Uh -oh. Sets up to throw it. And he's going to drop this off to his fullback. That'll leave him with a third and two coming up. They got eight yards there. That's a gain of eight. Brings up third. They'll try and run for it with Elliott. And he's going to get to the third and one enough for the first down. An effective seven yard right. third down conversion. Now a play fake here on first down. He's got a man. It's That's his true. Throwback. There you go, man. He's going to go Rock out of bounds, but he takes this one down just shy of the 20. 11 yards and a Cowboy first down. It's interesting because when I'm watching college football. I hope you niggas talk about it before the, the day before. Now, <laughs> <laughs> yeah. So what time are we getting there? <laughs> you got your ticket yet? <laughs> it doesn't matter what you call the position. It's who you put there. And there we saw completion. And he will reach the 8-yard line. Going out. Allowed to go play? Scrambling there. 12 yards first down. First and goal at the eight yard line. Now Elliott. And he will fight his way into the end zone for a Cowboy touchdown. Let's go! An eight yard touchdown run. You can't fucking hide it, son. Look too easy, and I think thanks goes to the offensive line for making it look easy. Yeah, I agree with you totally on that one. They want the Vegas sure much much everyone the understands the preparations. We never got, got the money for an offensive line because there's a reason that running backs and quarterbacks yeah, all this time, gifts the ones that couldn't the hide it after a big year, right in front the of them. Consistency them. and the continuity it takes to know each other you and, and execute their blocks. Ralph got that million dollar deal. He's playing for the trip, and that's what happened. Joey slide out to kick off after the touchdown. It's like she's gonna fly us out to Vegas and we get your million dollar deal. And this carries into the end zone. 
And this will not be returned. It'll come out to the 25. I'm going to tell you, I'm gonna tell you real simple and plain, no. Prepping for their next drive, the Bears offense. Well, there are two scores on the plus side. Still time here in this fourth quarter, but maybe you start thinking about playing keep away. Yeah, That's I think here's the situation. Gone, You're not thinking touchdowns anymore. You're just thinking first downs to keep up with your theme there, playing keep away. First downs, they can't touch the ball. First down, Bears. So here's a first and 10 at the 38. <laughs> on the carry, Montgomery. <laughs> And a six-yard gain gets him right around the 43. And I'm guessing you'd say this is kind of the key here. Grind out some yardage, work on that clock, see if you can continue to take it down. What? How did I miss that? At this point, right? Continue to possess the football, gain some yardage, and put the onus on the defense. Do they have to use timeouts? What are they doing? It's a foot race. 20. Touchdown, Chicago. David Montgomery, his second touchdown of the game, his third of the year. And the Bears will extend their lead. Well, CD, I mean, there are touchdown runs, and then there are touchdown runs. And that one certainly fell into the latter category. And that deserves a couple exclamation points. You don't know about that. Three touchdowns at 21 points. Bears 49. Cowboys 28. Eddie Pinheiro to kick off for Chicago. For who? Now after the touchdown, here's Pinheiro to kick it off. For two people, him and Pooh. That's it. That's gone. Man. No way. That could be a fucking homer. Are you playing baseball, bro? Bro, to the show, yeah. Well, the Dallas offense is here set player. to begin the drive. And they, unfortunately, are staring at a mini losing streak developing, trailing here in the fourth quarter. This will be their third straight defeat. Pressure and he's taken down. A bear sack. It's Khalil I'm getting good wood on these sliders. I'm about to say. We've been around this league for a while, and many coaches never pull their starting quarterback, almost no matter the situation. I say what I say. In this case, though, I think he's got to make a decision. He's taking a pretty good beating out there. Yeah, and with the deficit, maybe not wanting to risk an injury. Second down. Here's he Hurts. Stepping up, he'll try and run. Kirby, I know you play for the Miami, the Miami Hurricanes baseball team. You know about good wood. And with that kind of a deficit, you can't afford to make any kind of mistakes. But it's been pretty symptomatic what we've seen all game with them, isn't it? Yeah, I'm sure I play no Call of Duty. The name of stopped at the 30. Two yards on the pickup there. It'll be second and eight. I deleted it was uh, nobody was hopping on that joint with me. I deleted it. Uh, yeah, I wasn't okay, hopping I on it. Yeah, every time I was like, every time I was like, what was on? Not a little niggas who got on with me, bro. That's just the fact. Yeah, about that. A new set of downs. Clock continues to move. No better way to close out a game than to tap those mastodons out. Once they say, guys, keep pounding them. Let's keep the ball. Keep their offense on the sidelines. And let's close this one out. That man moving to Vegas. He ain't got time to play baseball. <laughs> and it looks like this will be the last play before the two-minute warning. Just two minutes remaining here in the fourth quarter of what has been a Still one work on cause and shit, Kirby. So the Bears oh, you the, the boss now? No, no, no. Last time I asked you about it, you was you were still working. Oh, you got the cannon. 
He the boss now. He the money man. That's what I'm saying. Nah, that's what's up, Kurt. <laughs> he the motherfucking money man, dog. He the one paying for the trip to Las Vegas. Hey, how far the Montgomery biscuits? Hey, I ain't hate money, Kurt. What? Just how far the Montgomery biscuits? Yeah, I was just gonna say the yeah. offensive line. Yes. Man, Montgomery. Been key, that's what's up. How far is that? That's probably four hours, three and a half hours. Oh. Nah, that's the team I was playing real quick. Oh, I never even seen that team. Clock counting down Ooh. toward 40 seconds as they take the knee. Did you say you be working on Ross cars and shit? And now can they reverse the trend? That's Look at it. Nah, yeah, I mean, we talked about it one time a while back. Here we are thinking Sykes is the, uh, knows that body, but it's really the curve. Yeah, Sykes out here meeting people from fucking uh, Star and, and Empire and shit. Not and not not Terrence Howard. You telling me you you met Maine and you ain't tell nobody? You just don't think you can do anything wrong. Whatever you call, run, pass, it's all gonna work. That's called being in the zone. You ain't me, no. So for He's the Bears, above. they get back in the win column as they move to two and Niggas one. Niggas, I kissing dudes. And they'll get another oh, test clout. next week as they have to go to Lambo to take on the Packers. They get the nigga that was kissing Jamal. That's your home side? Thanks is in the club with him, pulling up. They had a table to go. He said, hey, I may be drunk, but don't get hands with my nigga. certainly have to thank Charles Davis, my broadcast partner, and our entire crew. We'll catch you next time. Oh, you right here. It's the NFL on EA Sports. That nigga, bye.